guys, I'm Nesta and welcome back to an extra special edition of our house tours here in Dubai. Tonight we're in the Dubai Hills, an exclusive gated community developed by Imar Properties, the same company which bought you the Burj Khalifa and is situated one of the, next to the, one of the best golf courses in the UAE. This property is just about to go on the market, but it's thanks to our good friends at BCI Fit Out who have just finished fully remodeling this home from the ground up and we want to show you how ridiculously stunning it is. Specs on the villa is a fully integrated smart villa with five bedrooms, seven bathrooms, and an interior space of 8,053 square feet with an outdoor pool, all for just 27 million dirhams or around $8.3 million. Now, please, if you haven't subscribed already, please do so, hit that button, because it would mean so much to us. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. As we arrive at the front of the property and walk by this lovely water feature to the right, you can see here in this little cove, a small olive tree, which feels so peaceful. And down to the right of the building, there is a walkway towards the back. And here in the front, there is three palm trees, which immediately gives this tropical feel. It's stunning. Heading towards the entrance, we walk up these Italian travertine ivory steps which also makes the frame of this huge front door and right above it, this intricate brass feature that just looks stunning. Now, even though the door is huge, it opens with no effort at all and is so smooth. In the entrance lobby, you see this seamlessly floating staircase which leads upstairs, but we'll head up there later. On your right, there's this smooth wood panelling which extends all the way up to the ceiling and brings your attention to this exquisite chandelier. Down this corridor is the first bedroom and guest bathroom, but let's go through the living area first because it really is the first place that just pulls you in. So coming through then, you enter this huge open space with the lounge to your right and the kitchen and dining area to your left. This here is a custom-made TV wall with built-ins and Calcutta Macchia marble. Huge sofa coming from Italy. Now, all the loose furniture here is actually from Italy. It's all the best quality. Stunning custom-made artwork on the travertine ivory back wall. Wooden built-ins throughout the whole place and matching wooden paneling around these pillars with recessed lighting, marble floors throughout. It looks stunning. Moving on to the kitchen, we go by this seating area. While I've been here, this is probably the spot where I've sat the most. It kind of gives you a view onto the whole space where you can just appreciate it. Next is the custom made kitchen with the Orobico Grigio Marble Island. From the front, there is a breakfast bar and here is a $15,000 top brewer coffee machine which you can just select on your iPad and it just comes out of here it's crazy I've already started collecting my stamps here on the back wall you have the fridge and the freezer beautifully decorated of course you have this sliding doors which come out because this is actually a show kitchen it closes and you have storage upstairs. It just creates a seamless finish if you need it. You have the Miele oven opposite the kitchen. We move on to the dining area. Again, marble floors, travertine walls, beautiful light fixture, custom built-ins, and this Italian chairs and Italian marble table. Absolutely stunning. BCI, they use the best quality materials and they design and renovate homes ready to use with everything included. They just give you the keys, you just bring your belongings, that's it, you're ready to go.
So back by the staircase and down this corridor, the first door is your guest bathroom. Now it has the custom floating vanity and the walls clad with this travertine ivory throughout. Coming back, the next door is the guest bedroom with the custom built-ins on the right and the bathroom on the left. Gorgeous custom floating vanity design and marble throughout. Walk-in shower with a huge rain head and the essentials that you need. The bedroom has the wood paneling on the back with the recessed lighting all built in. You have the fully automated curtains. Now, if you come over here to this module right here, you can control all the curtains and the lights around this room. But with an iPad, you can control everything in the whole house. It's incredible. Now, let's go and see what we have upstairs. this floating staircase with the glass rails on the side it just looks stunning as we come up the stairs we have this custom made wooden cladding this is super expensive to do and amazingly difficult but it looks awesome on the landing there is a cozy living space with travertine walls throughout and a custom made tv setup here is a little zen tree, which looks amazing. Super comfy sofa and a side table here underneath. I think that's actually for umbrellas, but I'm not quite sure if you quite need umbrellas in Dubai. So behind you there is the primary bedroom and the office. But firstly, we'll go to the end of the corridor and work our way down to those. The first door on the right is the maid's room. Now this maid's room comes with a bathroom that's fully equipped with really nice equipment as well, but it's just still under construction with some final details left to do. You have the small wet kitchen in the corridor as well with the wine cooler here and some extra storage if you need it. Now we have the second bedroom. Coming in, we have the custom built-ins on the left with some shelving some tinted glass doors. On the right is the ensuite, another custom floating vanity and marble throughout. Of course, it has the walk-in and the rain head. We actually have wooden floors in this bedroom. All the bedrooms have their own sort of character, so they're not those hotel type clone bedrooms. Travertine walls in the back with wooden cladding and the custom TV setup wall here again. Now, you see even these drawers, they are custom cut. Everything here is just so unique, it's, it's stunning. The next bedroom as you come in has the built-ins on the right. But you can see the bathroom is totally different. You have the dark marble throughout and the floating vanity design. The walk-in again, great. In the bedroom you have the custom TV set up here again with the wooden cladding in the back. The wooden floors, it just makes it feel a bit warmer in this room. You have a great view onto your pool area, which you're going to see in a bit. Across from here is the only bedroom, which I might call the second bedroom. And I'll show you why in just a minute. Okay, it doesn't have as large a closet space as the other bedrooms, but all in all, it's slightly larger with a small seating area in the back, wooden cladding throughout, and you'll notice even some of the wooden cladding on the seat on the walls has been custom cut. But the pièce de résistance for me is the bathroom. The marble in here looks incredible. Firstly, it's all book matched, but if you look closely at the veins in the marble, to me it shows an image of a stag and it's all natural. The, the rest of the bathroom has the same marble throughout, floating vanity and the essential walk-in shower. Now let's head finally to the office and the primary bedroom. So the office is right across from the primary bedroom, which makes it a very short commute to work. There's the mirrored built-ins on your left and your own bathroom for the office on your right with this stunning light marble throughout and floating vanity design. The office itself, the main feature is this magnificent polished metal desk, the beautiful hanging light fixture above 
with the custom built-in wooden cladding in the back with the recessed lighting on the shelves. It looks amazing and so smart. Also on this side, the book matched Marvel TV setup with custom built-in in the bottom, the lasered marble as well, which is again, super expensive to make. This toy here, which is kind of similar to the blow-up dog we had in the first video. I don't know if you recognize that. Finally, let's take a look through the primary bedroom before we head outside to show you the stunning pool area. Coming into the primary bedroom, you see the tinted windows built-ins on this side with the walk-in closet just around the corner. But let's take a look at the primary bathroom. First, stunning travertine walls throughout with the two-tone, a double floating vanity and a standalone tub and a huge mirror which opens up this space even more. On this side of the tub, you have the water closet and on the other is the full walk-in shower. Now, back out to the walk-in closet. So here we have this cushion seating area where you can put your shoes on. There's so much space in here. It's, I don't know how I would fill it even. I would love to fill it, but that's not something I can afford right now, maybe in the future. Coming through to the bedroom, an Italian made bed throughout the whole house. They're all Italian made. On the back wall, this smooth felt material with the wooden clad walls as well. You have the automatic curtain, which is just in front of the balcony and a small seating area. You have a custom cut back wall cladding with this wave effect and the custom built-ins at the bottom, huge TV with the recessed lighting in the background. Now let's head to my favorite part of the house. It's the outdoor pool area. <laughs> Now for my favorite bit. So I want us to experience this opening together because press the button, curtains start to open and we'll experience this together because the view is just stunning. Now these doors open all the way out. Let me just open these. So as we step outside, let's take a moment and appreciate this stunning view. It looks gorgeous. In the middle, you have the two palm trees inside the pool. Over there on your left, you have the fire pit and in the middle, the jacuzzi. Heading towards that is the barbecue on this side. But first you go by this seating area, which you can chill and appreciate this whole thing. To the barbecue. Now here they have this setup with everything that you could possibly need. And it's the best Deli Vita barbecue equipment. You also have an ice maker, a pizza oven. Everything you need is here set up already for you. Coming back, you have the recessed lighting in the steps, creates a lovely ambiance. Go by that jacuzzi again towards the fire pit. Now this is one of my favorite spots to chill because I've actually never been in a fire pit before. So this is my first. It's hotter than I actually thought it was. You can have friends over, get a shisha out, sit, watch your pool and if you like the kind of same things that I do, please give us a like and show us some love in the comments. It would mean a lot to us. And as I said, if you haven't subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. But here, the fire pit is connected to your dining room towards the kitchen. And finally, the stunning water feature. Unfortunately, this ends our tour, but we're so grateful to have been here. And thank you to everyone who's watched us in the last video and this video. It does mean a lot as we progress. It's only going to get better. So I'll see you in the next tour. Peace and love.